the dish to Robertson. Minutes to Just five to shoot. Lynn adds a two-pointer. Rebounded by the Nets. Robinson's got four rebounds now tonight. He hit a three in the first, but so far has been unable to capitalize here in this quarter. Robinson a screen on Lynn. The kid passes to Robinson. Shot from 12. No good from the kid. Hornets have gone 5 of 11 from the field since the beginning of the second quarter. Let's go to our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Doris, what do you have? Well, Kev, Freak in the last matchup against the Heat delivered quite a performance. He picked up 10 points and stuffed the stat sheet with a double-double. A standout effort all around. He was just too much to handle as he came off the bench to turn in a great outing, guys. They hope it continues. Thanks, Doris. He had a heck of an outing that night, GA. Yeah, he really did, Kevin. I mean, a very professional performance. Played hard every single second he was on the court. Guys, that's what we expect from him, and he rarely lets us down. And he certainly didn't let us down that night. If he can improve on what's been a shaky day for him thus far, they could stretch this lead out. And it's Kid Gilchrist penetrating. He gets the whistle. Contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. And, and I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Definitely saved the layup with that foul, and he'll make him earn him from the line, and that's what you want to see. The Nets with the lead. Johnson kicks to Galloway. The Nets working the ball around now. They set the pick. Pass to the kick. The feed now to Johnson. Shot to end this cold run. Here's Bless. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it three. That's exactly what you want to see. I mean, they're doing a good job of scoring in the paint. Points in the paint. PIPs. That's what's going on here in the second. 20 seconds left to play here in the half. Outside, Lynn. Shot from 12. Got a piece of it. And they get it back. Second chance shot, and too long on the shot. And the first half comes to a con Kevin, we have... Here we go now, the start of the third quarter. Welcome. Teams deciding to change it up. Hornets trail by eight. Setting the floor for the Nets. Cork Mons. He's in a shooting guard. Bargnani is out there with Brooke Lopez. And it's Young and it's Jack in a patrol guard position. Battling through the impact there and then willing that basketball in. Boy, it does your heart good to see that kind of determination in a player. Really excellent focus that time. On the outside. Feeds it to Lopez. Great use of the pick to create room for the jumper. Lopez has got four this quarter. You know, the defense has got to do a much better job of fighting over those screens. And Greg, especially when the ball is in his hands. I mean, come on now. You know he doesn't miss too many open looks like that. Got it. Get the ball inside. Here's the kid. Guarded by Walker. The kid passes to Lopez. for Nicholas Batum. And so it's Brooklyn with it. It's a five-point game. Lock at six. Here's Lopez. Gets that one to fall. That's his sixth field goal. He has shot the ball 12 times. Charlotte's gone to the three-pointer 11 times tonight. Nailed five of them. Outside, Walker. He feeds it to Zeller. Goes in, and Bargnani sends it down. And that'll be Charlotte as it goes out of bounds. Hornets retain possession. Robinson's checked in for Brooklyn. Thomas Brooklyn. 
There's a good screen. Just four to shoot. The Hornets need to get a shot off here. Rejected by Bargnani. And they hold a huge advantage on the backboard. Greg, and that's been the key to this lead. I mean, they've really dominated the glass. And what's your take, guys, in the hustle stats for Brooklyn? Their defense has been outstanding, closing out on shots and blocking a few as well. And, guys, I think you've got to give them credit for the number of steals they've taken away. I mean, a lot of effort on the defense from them tonight. The Hornets have gone 9 of 13 from the line. The first one falling. And the Hornets making a change here. Kaminsky's checked in. And a switch here for Brooklyn. Galloway is checked in. He hits both from the strike. Brooklyn leading by seven. Outside Robinson. Pass to the kid. Pocket six. Brooklyn needs to get off a shot here. Fades and shoots. Will not go. This is off the front eye. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. Here's the list of players who had the most deals in the NBA last season. Fifth best, Kemba Walker. Two words for you about this guy. Fast hand. He was able to come away with the ball a lot last season. He found a way always. Take a look at what Zeller's done. He's got eight points, and when it comes to rebounding, he has, he's had a nice night there, too. He's not afraid to mix it up there in the middle, getting in there and doing a lot of the dirty work. There's a good screen. The kid passes to Blatch. Young against Kid Gilkins. Young's shot is off. Yeah, good tough D there to get a hand up and force that miss. That's example number one of why he is such a strong defensive player and why he has such a great defensive reputation. Robinson a screen on Walker. The kill passes the right. And the ball travels out of bounds. Last touch by Kid Gilchrist. Butler, he's checked in for Langston Galloway. Russell. So it's Brooklyn now. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. They get a hand on it. Now here's Lynn. Defense is right there. Zeller setting the pick for Lynn. He dishes it to Zeller. Walker goes in. Back to Zeller. Pulls it from the elbow. The rebound by Young. Young's got four rebounds in this game. Here's the screen. Outside Robinson. He kicks it to Young. Here's the kid. Guarded by Walker. Down to five on the shot clock. And again, no good by Brooklyn. Hornets trail by four. And it's Kid Gilchrist penetrating. As he misses, he'll go to the line and shoot two. And a brief check of the stats for Lynn. How he did last season. Last season put up about nine points a game. Five assists and two rebounds. And those numbers, solid. Not spectacular. And, and sometimes what you see is what you get. He certainly knows his role. And he gives you some good minutes. That's really all you can expect from him at this point. Nets leading by three. Here's the kid, 11 points in the game. And there's the pass to Blanche. Off the mark, and the drop continues. Charlotte is gone, one of three from downtown since halftime. A nice shot by Lee. And with that speed, once he took off, the D just had no chance of getting back. Well, I think they did the right thing. I mean, just give up the two points and move forward. Hey, discretion is the better part of valor sometimes. Write that one down, game player. Discretion is the better part of valor. The kid passes the right. Terrific design on the pick plus. He lays it in. Robinson's got his second best. Hornets trail by three.
chance here now to see how the Nets ranked in the NBA last season. Sixth in opponent points per game. Seventh in free throw percentage. And they were in the top ten in steals as well. I mean, this is a team that really gets after people defensively. Deflections, pressure on the ball, all of that leads to steals. And, and back to their ranking in terms of opponents' points per game. Kind of an old-school stat, but sometimes pace of play can factor in. But, but make no mistake, they made things difficult for their offense. He's having quite the quarter here, guys. I mean, shooting the ball extremely well. The kid passes to Butler. Here's the kid, defended by Lynn. The shot. Rebounded by Kaminsky. Charlotte has gone into the three-point range four times since halftime and buried two of them. And Walker kicks to Kaminsky. Kid Gilchrist dishes to Zeller. Inside, Kaminsky. Robinson with the block. And that's out of bounds. Charlotte will retain possession. One twenty-five left to play in the third. Four on the shot clock. Lynn's shot is off. That's a very low percentage shot. Not good basketball at all. One he probably should have passed on. Here's the kid. Eleven points in the game. It's stolen by Kaminsky. And himself pushes it down to finish the break. Hey guys, that's a big swing right there. I mean, taking the steal and then turning it into two easy points on the day. No telling how important that sequence could turn out to be. And guys, in a game this snug, moments like that are the ones we usually look back on at the end as a difference maker. How about that fantastic finish and the aggressive move, too, Kevin? Trying to send a message flying with that slam, I think. And, and I'm not sure if it was text or email, but he definitely <laughs> threw that one down. He's covered closely. Six to shoot. On deep. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. You know, sometimes the intensity of the game can lead to brain neutral plays like that, guys. Jefferson's checked in for Charlotte. Joe Johnson, he's checked in for the Nets. Here's the kid. Robinson wide open, he shoots. All right, Charlotte, now we're going to court for your beautiful We've got a great game on our hands. And he's checked in for Nicholas Batum. Here's Roberson. 106 left in the fourth quarter. And hey guys, what we saw here tonight is one side having everything going for them. Huge margin of victory for Brooklyn. Better shooting from the charity stripe was what made the difference, I think, Clark, in this one. And I think it was a matter of concentration, Kevin. They really locked in from the line. And so with this, they'll end up with their second win on the year. And they'll take the win tonight, setting the tone in the first matchup of this four-game season series. And it will be a fight, Greg. When you see an opponent that many times, it's inevitable that those games take on a little extra added a good win and a lot went into it but I just like the showing for Lopez you can set a tone with defense and that's exactly what he did with how he protected the rim Kemba Walker is out there with Roberson then there's Michael Kidd Gilchrist then there's Al Jefferson and it's Kaminsky in at the four spot so that's the Hornets five Twenty six seconds left to play in the final much. quarter. The kid passes to Robinson. Here's the kid guarded by Walker. Just four to shoot. Dishes it to Robinson. Rebounded by Kaminsky. Well, he, he gets it in close, but you have to credit that stifling defense for forcing the miss. Exactly, Greg. I mean, defense like that really increases the degree of difficulty on that shot by a large amount. And so it's Brooklyn.